GPT-4, the future of AI language processing. We all know that the GPT-3 AI engine was a significant advancement. In comparison to GPT-2, the updated model could spit out paragraphs with fluency. The discussion of the next big thing has been relatively muted since the release of GPT-3. Now we have more information about GPT-4. Some predict that GPT-4 will be disruptive and game-changing, but what will the truth be? People reacted positively when GPT-3 was launched on June 11, 2020. When open when AI launches DPT-4, the reaction could be even more positive. Hello and welcome to our channel. Today we'll talk about the OpenAI GPT-4 language model. This video will take a look at the latest advancements in AI and natural language processing and how GPT-4 is about to change the game. GPT-4 is a language processing model that uses AI to generate human-like text. GPT-4 employs natural language generation, NLG and natural language processing in contrast to other AI language models models, deep learning models, and machine learning models. Due to the NDA, the specific details of the GPT-4 specifications are still in flux. However, GPT-4 is expected to use 100 trillion parameters. The first big scale model with a sparse core design is here. Sparsity shows that even in the 100T parameter space, the compute cost is likely to be lower, which is what it means. This indicates that the final model still has a lot of active neurons. In layman's terms, it is a model that can keep a lot more options for the following word, sentence, and emotion based on the context. This essentially means that it is more similar to real human thinking than its predecessor. You may go far bigger than simply asking Alexa to play your favorite song or have Siri type your text. Using GPT-4, you can produce 100 ideas for social media posts in less than two minutes or write a full ebook in 10 minutes. GPT-4 is a pre-trained model, which means it has been trained on a big text data set and can perform language processing tasks more accurately. It is capable of continuing to generate text based on its previous output and can generate text based on the input it receives. How is it different from previous language models? Model size. Altman says GPT-4 will not be much bigger than GPT-3. So so it's similar to DeepMind's Gopher language model. We can assume that it will have around 175 billion to 280 billion parameters with 530 billion parameters. The large model Megatron in ALGA is three times larger than GPT-3 but performed no better. The smaller model that came after it reached higher performance levels. To put it simply, a bigger size does not mean higher performance. Altman said that they are focusing on improving the performance of smaller models. A large data set, a lot of computing power, and a complicated implementation were necessary for the large language models. But for a number of businesses, deploying large models becomes too expensive. AI alignment. The alignment of the GPT-4 will be better than GPT-3. OpenAI has difficulty aligning AI. They want language models to reflect our values and intentions. They have started by constructing Instruct GPT. It is a GPT-3 model that has been instructed to follow instructions by humans. Human judges thought the model was better than GPT-3 regardless of language standards. Multimodality. GPT-4 will be a text-only model. Because we live in a multimodal world, multimodal models are the future of deep learning. Our brains are multisensory. AI's ability to navigate or understand the world is severely limited by its ability to perceive it in one mode at a time. However, compared to good language-only or vision-only models, good multimodal models are significantly more challenging to construct. It is difficult to combine textual and visual information into a single representation. We don't know how to put it into neural networks because we only know a small amount about how our brains work. Not that the deep learning community is taking into account insights from the cognitive sciences on brain structure and functionality. Altman said in question answer that GPT-4 will be a text-only model, not a multimodal model like Dolly or Mum, but rather a text-only model. Some suggest that before going on to the next generation of multimodal AI, they are seeking to push the boundaries of language models by adjusting factors such as model or data set size. Potential applications. GPT-3 has already been utilized in content generation, chatbots, virtual assistants, and other applications. It was additionally employed in machine learning and natural language processing research. GPT-4 is anticipated to have even more applications, particularly in creative writing and art. Additionally, it is anticipated to boost the performance of current applications like chatbots and virtual assistants. GPT-4 is expected to overcome these constraints and significantly outperform GPT-3.
GPT-3. GPT-4 could also be useful in creative fields like writing, music composition, and making art. The revolutionary design of GPT-4 makes it easier to comprehend and replicate human behavior. To put it another way, it can keep learning how to make text that is more human-like and believable. Some of the uses for GPT-4 are as follows. Answer in-depth inquiries, translate text into various languages, summarize lengthy passages, and begin from scratch the creation of long-form content, such as blog posts and articles. To make these content types, just type natural language into the query bar. No matter how brief your prompts are, the model will then turn them into text that is more comprehensive. OpenAI thinks that GPT-4 may be more accurate and able to follow instructions more effectively. This is due to the fact that one of the most pressing issues in AI and data science is AI alignment issues which are less prevalent in its design. In addition, it is easier to use the human brain and figure out what users want. It is also possible to use it to describe the difficulty of creating an AI system that is compatible with relatable values, desires, and beliefs. Additionally, the high power of accuracy is presumptuous. According to them, GPT-4 will have a neural network with five times the capacity of other AI tools and language models. What does it mean for businesses? The next generation of the open AI framework, GPT-4 might change the face of language modeling. The fact that 100 trillion machine learning parameters are used in GPT-4 versus 175 billion in the current model is the most obvious and astonishing difference between the two models. The technology is also departing from the concept that bigger is better, even though GPT-4 will have significantly more parameters than GPT-3. Adam Lieberman, who is in charge of AI and machine learning at Finastra, says that in the future he wants to see a smaller increase in model size and parameters. According to Lieberman, GPT-3 demonstrated to the community that it meant business by completing the code and finding tax deductions. The emergence of GPT-4 will contribute to the growing awareness that AI is becoming less rigid and more compassionate. With a new and improved version of our GPT language model, we expect to see enhanced use cases utilizing the power of language modeling across numerous domains. He continues, we are excited to see all the new use cases that will emerge. Use cases in which GPT-3 performs suboptimally have a second chance at the free throw line. With the introduction of GPT-4, internet users will frequently encounter AI-generated content. This is already taking place, but if the results are better, more people will probably use it. Inevitably, cybercriminals will also start to use the technology, making it more difficult to distinguish certain communications. The benefits for businesses will be less time spent on day-to-day -day content creation and the possibility of writing previously difficult or impossible content like essays and full articles. Here is a look at how GPT-4 can potentially impact the market. Language processing will change the way marketing works by automating the writing of posts about different marketing strategies and making responses that are more like what real people would say. Customer support will be more effective and be able to provide multifaceted services. GPT-4 will create personalized learning experiences which will have a groundbreaking effect on education. It will be easy to produce a lot of relevant business content in multiple languages. The language used in blogs, articles, social media posts, and product descriptions will be exactly as it is used by humans. The disadvantage is that fake news under the guise of human-like writing is likely to be produced. Because of this, it will be difficult to tell fact from fiction. In conclusion, GPT-4 will raise the bar for automated text, but it is still a long way from achieving language comprehension comparable to that of humans. However, GPT-4 will include a larger context window memory to make it easier to correct human errors and complete difficult tasks. So that's all for today's video. If you like this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the notification bell for more videos. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the following video.